We're back. Welcome back to Orcs Must Die again. Uh, <coughs> pardon the audio last time. I oops. Or not the audio. Pardon the video last time. Just my face. Um, I've just been having troubles with my webcam. I don't know why. It's only recently gotten this sort of um, issue. There's this interesting subsystem where they'll just organize your uh, uh, hotbar to have all the weapons on one place anyway, which is nice. So you can see that this also now introduces portals. So you can see that this kicks us out here. And then this is an alternate path that leads us upstairs and kicks us into here in a different way. But there is only one door. So I believe what we can do is just, yeah. So see the blue line now goes this way. Just the first guy out the door is gonna get a really mean surprise. There he goes. And the drink. But yeah, I was just, um, I was reading to make sure. And yes, in fact, you cannot play Orcs in the Sion Chain anymore. Robot is an indie company and they can't support the, the server costs. So they were unable to run the game for any longer. And like, that's a shame. You know, content that is temporary is always in some way unfortunate, you know? It makes me sad at the very least. The, the idea of, you know, the idea of just saying we're not going to be able to play this game forever kind of like, you know? It's again why I don't support Stadia. And like, you know, for years I was saying, hey, Stadia is going to take your money at some point. At some point you're going to, you know, lose your games when Stadia inevitably shuts down. And I, ordinarily I would not take pleasure in being right. Because obviously that sucks for me. It's, it's unfortunate and annoying that a company can just decide this thing that you have put money and time into is no longer a profit margin for us so we'll just take it away from you because it's too much of a problem for us and that's pathetic i think i think that's a very unfortunate like problem with modern day well modern day there we go Um, and the reason that I say ordinarily I don't take pleasure in it is because people who are fans of Sadia got weird. Like, so many of them were, like, tech bros. Like, they were into crypto or whatever. And they were so full of themselves for, like, having this, like, superior egalitarian patrician's gaming console. You know? Now, there were a bunch of normal people who were playing Stadium as well, but obviously people who are weird about it are loud. But yeah, so after they had to shut down the servers for Orcs Must Die Unchained and made a game that you can't play anymore, they released Orcs Must Die 3 with Stadia exclusive. And like, that's super weird. That's baffling to me. 
like it's as though they didn't learn their lesson from having a from having a, a, a game that went under just due to I got past me. Glad I looked. Did they bounce off the wall? That's kind of funny. Where's this guy? So oh, he's like stuck there. the cash for these. must have hit each other in midair. Oh, this is bad. Yeah, Acid does damage over time in this game instead of just being an instant kill. That was something that they changed in the sequel. <laughs> 